Welcome friends and family. Well, uh, I think I got some bad news is that I killed the, or I didn't kill the one lady. She actually helped, gives you some stuff to defeat the guy after you convince her that what she did was wrong. And then you gotta go over to her mom's house, what I haven't done yet. It's supposed to give you a dress so you can put it on the dress, because it only works on dresses, I guess. And the whole part that I just did, get this, it didn't error out. What happened is it loaded into the capture thingy, you know, and uh, it will not go to any type of format. For whatever reason, it just refuses to do anything. So, I can't do anything with that. So, that whole part got skipped, and I'm not going to reboot the entire game to get to that one part. Not that anybody's, not that this is so old, it's probably not getting views, but I don't feel like doing all that stuff all over again. Everything I did. So, I'm not gonna get everything, but. Thank you. Wait. It says something about guys attacking the village, too. And I should probably take a visit to the. Whatchamacallit calls it? Uh, the freaking. Um, mine. These guys I can kill. Let's do this real fast. Wait, that's. Oh, I got that now. What? Nice. I'm almost gonna pass that 100, but I wanna see if I can get past. Okay, stop attacking me, little bitch. But okay. Don't worry, my health regeneration, remember? So I should be fine. I check up here just because I, it seems like that's a lot of necromancers to kill. Guess not. There's no necromancer over here. Okay then. I do hope you've been looking after yourself. You already look so grown up. Indeed. It's good to see you too, but I'm afraid I won't be staying for long. I actually came back to ask for help. I need you to alter a dress. You came all the way back here to ask me to alter a dress? A very special dress. If you can, I need you to combine this dust with the thread. I will ask no more. Come back tomorrow, and your dress will be waiting. Ah, Scarlet. I finished your dress for you. I hope you like it. 
I used the finest materials I had. I guess it's time to say goodbye again. Good luck, Scarlet, and come back safe. Alrighty then. Let's do this. Okay. No slash resistant though. I need to get my magic ability up too. In my combat. Let me make sure to talk to, uh... I'm gonna talk to the Necromancer first, so I'm not sure, uh... My experience or my other stuff goes to it, so... It automatically went up one. Huh, oh, how do you notice that? In that case, I might, I might just give myself extra health. Something you need to All right. Let's stop him.
Never mind, I don't even care. It fucked me, it showed once when I did twice, and I wasn't sure what was going on, so screw that noise. Yeah, I was supposed to go in that doorway like when I went to the Lunar Rock or whatever. the site. I'll get a combo you if you like get one hit on you. Fucking bullshit. Wow. I I die from hitting them. That makes perfect sense. go uh, yeah give him a free hit for no reason woo woo that makes perfect sense woo that makes sense that's a good game mechanic right there. Okay then. That was very nice taking all my life for no reason.
At least by the time we get anywhere, my house is going to be regenerated. I go past it really? My bad. No more miners, no more all. Yes, I found some miners that will join you. Thank you. Now we can start mining again. Here's a little reward for your efforts. Uh. The copper mine has been reopened. Our village will live again. Very nice. If I kill those three uh, beasts, I could have given her the heart. Thank you. Yeah. More running. I don't have is the uh, heart one. Hopefully, I can get enough experience. I thought there's supposed to be an achievement for getting a certain level too. In fact, I'll check it right now.
Yeah, it is 32. I knew it was 32. Yeah, I doubt I'm going to kill the boss once and go up four levels. Or three and a half levels, but. We'll see. I'll save before I do it so I'll know what to look for and figure out. Save right here, I'll save right before I get my soul stats on the other end. I think there's a physical trainer also uh, in the whatchamacallit quarters to the right. What can I do for you? I want to learn necromancy. You know this knowledge is old, but I will not stand it. Blood Vortex. This is the fourth one. Can't get those yet. Oh, that looks good. And Check there and see if that's my last ability. Oh, hello. Might only be like a trade thing, but I thought there was like a uh, thing in here too. Ready yes. for a teach me. I can. 
why can't they learn these? You must have to learn from somewhere else. I doubt you just gotta learn every little thing. We'll find out, I guess. Let's do this. Okay. What is it? I want to use the platform. Send the... Flat. Yes? I want to use the... Lady? But uh, where is your escort? You should see the steward at once. Please, come in. Alrighty then. You must be from the Portuguese delegation. We had heard that your ship was destroyed in a tempest. Sometimes, not all we hear is true. Too true, especially in a place like this. Anyway, you are the last emissary to assure the Doge of their country's loyalty. I assume he's rewarded you sufficiently for your support. Either way, I'm afraid the security here has been increased recently, what with all the disturbances in the city. 
To allow you to gain access to the important parts of the palace, we first need to be sure of your integrity. I am the steward of the Doge's palace. Nothing happens in this building without my knowledge. When you are ready to prove your integrity, simply return here to me, and we shall begin the process. I'll come back later. I'm gonna save the hell out of this. How can I help? How do I prove my integrity? Before we allow you access to the palace proper, we need to be sure that there's no entry about you in the city registry. As long as you've never been in trouble with the law, I'm sure you'll pass this check fine. Please go to the city council hall, which is at the northern end of the corridor, and request a corresponding legal note. Then you should go and see Lucio, who is head of the palace guard. If he doesn't lock you up immediately, then I shall be content. <laughs> okay. I'll come back. Hello? S Scarlet, it's me. Ulrich? What? Well, I am a guard now. I'm only waiting for Lucio to finish my uniform. But don't worry, I'm on your side. I came here to help. I'll spread word amongst the guards. Tell them how you helped me. That way you should never be hassled again. Bane. If you need me, you know where I am. What can I do for you? I want to learn some fight. Well, I'm not really... What do you want? I'm sorry. I'm just very busy. Someone blew up a delivery of gunpowder that was intended for the Doge. But maybe it was better this way. I am Lucio. I'm head of the Palace Guards and controller of Palace Arms. I don't seem to remember your face, which is a good thing, as most people I know end up either dead or locked in the Palace Dungeon. So, I wish you a pleasant stay in this ramshackle structure that once was the pride of Venice. Yes? What arms do you have? Nothing better than one once, or I'm sure. Damn. Yes? Can you cast? I'll come back. See you later. Good day. 
Alrighty then. Alrighty to the then. Should be useful. Old texts and songs, huh? Maybe it wasn't so useful. I like how no one gives oh. a crap that Hello. they were oh. killing like Hello. monsters. Oh well. There's my next ability thingy. Wait, did I circle the whole thing? Yeah, I think I did. What the hell?
Good day. How can I help you? I've been to see Lucio. And you're still walking freely. That is a good sign. I'm afraid, however, you still need the legal note. How do I prove my integrity? Before we allow you as long, please go to the City Council Hall, which is at the northern end of the corridor, and request a corresponding legal note. Then you should go and see Lucy. Northern part. I'll come back. Okay, so I was over there. Great, more walking. Full circle again while missing something? What the hell? One's upstairs or something? That was saying somehow it's upstairs and there's no way to get upstairs, so I'm confused. <sighs> Alrighty then. Be upstairs somehow. Oh, it's right here on the sides. Wow. I miss that big time. Complicated decision. Oh. We don't have time to talk to citizens. Correct. Too much paperwork to go through. New laws, old laws. I need a legal note. So, who's supporting section 27, subsection 3? Three against, three in favor. Ah, a tie. And when there's a tie...
I need a legal note for the steward. Ah, the steward. Family matters again. I can't be bothered. Just help yourself to the permit from the stack down there. Concerning that problem with the rats. Oh, as old as Venice itself. Right. File it away. Goodbye. For the end. Alrighty then. Good day! How can I help you? How do I prove... Uh, please, then... I have the notes. Oh, jolly good. Thank you. Farewell. Feel free to make yourself at home in the great palace of the Doge. But first, we need to discuss some more pressing matters. We've just received word that allies of the Doge have been attacked. An African tribe, who are bound to the Doge's word just as you are, were attacked at the harbor. We know that the Order of the Holy Seal was involved, and no one can strike at the Doge and get away with it. We must quash this uprising now. The guilds must pay for their actions. Our problem is these old guilds operate beneath the reach of law. Their numbers may be few, but loyalty within is strong, which is why we came up with this plan. We need someone to earn their trust, so we can strike from the inside. Now, I couldn't help but notice, but you are wearing that guild's badge. Of course, I would never suspect you of such treachery. But as you have ties to the guild in question, perhaps you could help. We need you to get inside the guild and let the guards in. Of course, if you can do this for me, I will have no doubt of your integrity. But be careful. Were you to give them an inkling that you were working for us, I dare not think of the consequences. Scum. How could they betray our doge? They deserve everything that's coming to them. Now that's what I wanted to hear. When you're ready to lead our guards to these traitors, go and find Lucio.
The steward told me that you can lead us to that treacherous guild. Tell me when you're ready, and I will send my men with you. I'm ready to pay the order a visit. Good. Let's go and burn that wretched house down. All right. I hope you'll excuse our roughness, but a traitor, coming with torches, and the doge's henchman, deserves no better. But perhaps I should introduce myself first. I am the secret guildmaster, head of the three guilds of this city. But you are a traitor, <laughs> and now you must meet your punishment. First we shall cut out your tongue. Then we'll pluck off your fingernails and throw them into boiling oil. Your eyeballs shall be gnawed away by rats. And your nose? Well, I'll think of something for your nose later. Surrender now, old woman. My guards will be here any minute. So, this is how your story ends. The guildmaster dirtying her hands with the blood of a member. I'm sorry it had to come to this. What's going on here? Here they come. Henchmen in shiny mail, slow as ever. You have rebelled against His Excellency the Doge. You will now be punished. Punished? You should be punished. You should be quartered. And then your arms and legs should be boiled in hot oil for hours. What's the point in boiling the arms and legs after the quartering? Oh, whatever. You know what I mean. Leave them to me. You I am part of your damn girl, little whore. Not my face. They're a part of this guild anyway, so I don't know what they're talking about. Here we are. Now let's burn the traitor. Burn it to the ground. Okay. Nothing over there.
No, not the dungeon. We demand a fair trial. Shut up, traitors. The city council will know how best to deal with you. Alrighty then. I knew you could be trusted. I told them. Here is the key. It's been a pleasure working with you. You are like family to me now. If you ever need anything, okay. you are like... This random skeleton in the middle of nowhere. Why, oh, why do you awaken me? What keeps your spirit in this world? What a relief! Finally, I found someone who can listen to my story. Do you know it? Do you know the way out? I didn't find it. Well, after they lost me, they cut down some hedges to make this maze a little easier, I guess. Now you know my secret, and I am free. Ooh. Alrighty then. That didn't tell me anything because blocked, blocked whatever it was trying to show me. We basically died in this maze. That's nice to know. find the pieces Use the statue somewhere. Kinda weird. But okay. Uh, to find those pieces and now come back 